I'm try and get, <laughs> come on Connie, leave Kelly alone, babe. I'm gonna try and get the car packed tonight um, because obviously I can't do it with the two kids. So I'm gonna get it packed and then while they're at daycare tomorrow, it'll give me a chance to do a quick training session. You've already had two milks, baby girl. Would you like to pick out your favorite jumper for us to take camping? I know you love milk all the time and it's your favorite. Um, gonna get the car packed tonight so it's one less thing to stress myself out about tomorrow and then that gives me the whole night then to like anxiety overthink about everything I haven't packed and then I can do it in the morning whereas normally I do that when it's too late. So that's gonna be my plan of attack. So I'm gonna start getting things together. I also for the camping trip got this projector off Amazon so it's above me <laughs> at the moment because I'm um setting it up and it was only about a hundred bucks i'll link it in the caption below um but yeah it's just doing an update at the moment so i'm going to get it all set up and then i got a big projector screen because i thought we could maybe do like an outdoor movie night with the kids see how it all works god it is bloody fighting so i didn't end up loading everything in the car last night but i've got everything pre-ready to load in the car once i get the girls at daycare so Yay. hey jeez Honey, cheese. I'm gonna get these little ones dropped at daycare, go train, go drive over to Alicia and get my pinches done, come back, load the car, eat lunch, pick them up, bounce. <laughs> Just call me the Tetris master at this point. So, I think I have everything. I'm in the car. Got lunch, look how good this lunch looks though. So. Lunch is sorted, because I'm not gonna have a chance to really eat again. I've got a three hour drive. So it turns out I don't have camper chairs. Tommy seems to have taken my camping chair with him when he left and didn't tell me. So I'm just going to swing past Kmart now and just grab a cheap one because I'm not, my knees are not meant for sitting on the ground. Grab a cheap one and then swing through daycare, grab them, and then oh, we are on the way. Stop me. Got children. That's the only bottle I've got. Kids are in the car. Just had to double back and get the air fryer because there's a couple of things I need to make with a ready the air fryer. I don't think I've got everything. And off we go. Three hours. Coming on our trip. There's what friends have you got? You've got Adeline, you've got Skylar, Evie, Summer, Zara, you've got Frankie, you've got Sav, and then you're gonna meet River, Banjo, and Bowen. So many friends. Yeah. But first coffee, just waiting in the giraffe's lineup. They will be wearing shoes. So do you know what that means? Mm -hmm. You should wear shoes as well. So everyone's wearing shoes. Yeah. Keeps your feet clean. I want to keep my feet clean. Don't I you? Feet in there. Dirty. Dirty. I bet. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah. Is Chili excited? Yeah. Is Chili asleep already? Maybe. Hopefully, hopefully, we'll be getting here about 3 p.m. Oh, she's still awake? All right, 3 p.m., smooth sailing. We have everything. We have everything. I'm manifesting that we have not forgotten anything other than Dimadon, but I'm sure one of the other moms will.
Right, we, Callie, don't throw that. Semi, semi rained out a little bit, but. Hey, Semi. Brent forgot the poles to his tent. His mattress went down, but our mattress was pretty good, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. Okay. Everything. I think I'm actually dreading going home and having to unpack everything with the kids by myself the most. Um, you clean off all of the mud, but it's been such such a good trip. It definitely got a bit crazy with the mud there at one point, which I know Callie was really impressed about because she loves playing in mud. Um, but yesterday was a beautiful day. Um, this place would actually be really cool in the summer because in this lake here, They've actually got like a little water slide that goes down into the water and they've got kayaks. So this is definitely somewhere that I would come back um, in summer, but even in winter with all of the animals and then they've got like a giant, you can probably see the kids actually in the background, a giant um, trampoline that has no sides. So of course the kids loved it because there's that little hint of danger. Um, the only thing I would recommend is where we camped. We camped in this area because we could all be sort of close together. But if you need electricity, the powered kitchen is probably like a 400 meter walk, would probably be my guess. But it's been great for steps. I've been getting like 14,000 steps every day. Um, and no shower facilities, so I probably smell anything. Um, and the toilet is like a compost toilet as well so you've got to sort of you know take your waste with you and all of that but that's probably what else there's a fridge up there which is really great and I just brought my air fryer um we brought a microwave with us because mummy's gonna go make her protein oats in a minute hey but it's been fun hasn't it darling it's been fun we've had a great time 